Hey guys, Funky here. I'm gonna do a video about what we know about Hitman 3. Hitman 3 is the end of the trilogy, which I haven't even got to play the second one yet. The good news is Hitman 3 comes with the other two Hitmans, so if you pay for Hitman 3, you'll be able to play the other Hitmans, and it will be available for all current consoles, pretty much even the Switch. So Hitman 3 will include the other two installments, and people would ask, what's the storage space gonna look like? I've looked it up, it's gonna be around 100 gigabytes after Hitman 3. Sounds like a lot, but they actually compressed the living crap out of it, so it's, and removed all the duplicates and redundant assets so it's technically a pretty good deal for storage capacity because it's literally three games in one. Oh, also the game is going to be on vr the unfortunate thing is it's playstation vr i don't know about you i actually kind of like hitman the different play styles you can do with it such as like shoot em up just running around killing everybody stealth it's all fun and games and then figuring out how to actually do it correctly after a little bit it's a little challenging but it's fun but yeah like you'll be able to do all three games within this one hitman 3 has the same game modes as the previous installments such as the campaign which you can import saves from the other games so you can have all that stuff with it too elusive targets escalations contract mode so you can kill that random old lady on the street if you want if someone makes that contract or you can make it yourself Sniper assassination, which is supposedly a co-op assassination sort of thing. And a new mode called Ghost, which is a 1v1 game. You probably know when it comes out, but if you if you don't, the game is actually coming out this month of January on the 20th. January 20th, 2020. Pretty soon, actually. <laughs> I think I got the numbers mixed up. It's January 20, 2021. Here's my final thoughts on Hitman 3. So it comes out near the end of this month and it comes with Hitman and Hitman 2. Well, not not really those they come with it, but you'll be able to do the last campaign on those two. So if you haven't played those and you're interested in Hitman, I would probably wait, play this one and be able to play the other two Hitman within this game all in one. All right, I'm going to wrap up this video. So if you guys liked it, hit the like. And if you like the channel, feel free to subscribe. And if you like just this content in general, comment. And I'll think about doing some more of this stuff. I, I was actually entertained. I'm looking this stuff up and figuring all this stuff and just kind of make it in a video format, such like that. Anyways, have a good one and feel free to play your Nintendo Switch at the store playing Hitman and be like killing people, I guess. I don't know. Peace.